welcome to the channel today we are going to balance this reaction look this is nitrogen dioxide this is water this is nitric acid and this is nitrogen oxide right okay to balance this reaction at first we have to draw a table like this and then this is reactant side and this is product side now we need to count the number of atoms from both sides so here in the left hand side we have nitrogen which is one then look here we have oxygen that is two and in this compound we have hydrogen that is two and here we have one more oxygen so we have to add here one so that we are basically we are getting three oxygen in the left hand side in the right hand side we have hydrogen that is one and then we have nitrogen which is also one then here we have oxygen that is three and here we have nitrogen that is one so let me add one more nitrogen so two and here we have oxygen so basically we are getting four oxygen right okay look to balance this reaction means we have to balance the number of nitrogen oxygen and hydrogen from both sides of this reaction so look if i target to balance the nitrogen first then what will happen look this nitrogen may come from one compound which is nitrogen dioxide and this nitrogen may come from nitric acid or nit ni nitric acid or uh, or nitrogen oxide so this nitrogen may come from two compounds usually you have to uh, leave such type of atom to balance first because if a atom may come from more than one compounds and if you want to target to balance that atom first then this that will create problems so leave it so next move to oxygen usually we balance the oxygen uh, last at last right look at here this oxygen may come from here or here that is more than one compound so leave it right then hydrogen hydrogen uh, here may come from only one compound and this hydrogen may come from only one compound so let me uh, balance the hydrogen first so look here we have two but here we have one so balance the hydrogen what can i do i can simply multiply here by two that gives me two if you multiply by something that something must come before the atom so this two will come before this hydrogen as a coefficient so here so i have to place here two look if I place here 2, the number of hydrogen will be 2, the number of nitrogen will be here 2. So let me change. So basically we are getting 3. The number of oxygen here 3 times to 6. So let me change here. 6. 6 plus 1 that is 7. Totally we are getting 7, right? okay so hydrogen is balanced but look our nitrogen here one but here three so nitrogen is not balanced so to balance the nitrogen what can do i can multiply here by three that gives me three this three must come before this nitrogen that is here if i place here three the number of nitrogen will be three the number of oxygen three times two that is six so i have to change here six so if i add then i am getting here seven so nitrogen three three oxygen seven seven and hydrogen two two right so everything is balanced so you can say that this is the balanced equation so at last you can change this arrow sign with equal sign right so this is the balanced equation between the reaction of nitrogen dioxide and and water right so thank you for viewing this video be well